Alright guys, what's back? Uh, welcome back. It's been a while since I've done a video. Um, been a long time, actually. But I'm actually going to give you guys a really great tutorial here on how to get GTA 5 for free. And this will have proof that this does work as well. So, you know, it's going to be awesome. Um, this does take a lot of time, so I'm going to go ahead and warn you guys now. If you don't have a range of between anywhere between four to four hours to a day, then you might be better off buying the game because this is a very excuse me very long process, but it works. All right, so. This is not like my last tutorials where you just ran the EXE and finish stuff, but it is also not using torrents. Um, what you do have to do is, this is where I got the game from. It took me about a day to fully finish getting it, but I'm going to show you guys a trick to doing it, so it doesn't take you forever. So, you're going to come over to this website right here. And I know this looks really sketchy. You know, it looks like one of them cheap websites that has surveys or something, but it's not. So, I'm going to put this link in the description, and it is called that and the reason I'm saying this is going to take forever guys is because of this scroll on down the page you have to download all 31 parts doesn't matter which link you choose which links you choose you can mix them up but you have to download all 31 parts of this so what I did actually guys is I chose the mega one and downloaded the extension for mega and you have to skip the ad fly things so you know that's kind of time consuming too but, this is actually the site I get most of my games from that are cracked. Um, so, let's see here. Alright, so right here. And it's going to bring up part one. It's two gigs. So, like I said, guys, this is a huge game. You need to have a lot of free space in your computer as well. Um, I already have it installed, so I'm not going to do this. But, instead of just clicking download, open up about ten of them at once. Make an account. With this, it's free. You don't even have to verify the email. Uh, and import it to your cloud drive. And I'm going to show you guys this method real quick if I'm logged in. I think I am still. I am. Okay, so import this to your cloud drive. And it's going to show up right there. I don't know what this is. Oh, this is my GTA 4 that I uploaded. Now this one is the one that we just got. So add every single part to your cloud drive. And I know you're going to probably come across the problem that you only get 50 gigs of free space. This is why I said again, it's time consuming. Very time consuming. This is exactly how I did it. So I suggest adding them until you can't, until you have no space left. Then letting it download, like highlight all of them, like drag like that, and then it'll give you the option to download. And it'll queue all of them at once. And then just like leave your computer while you go to school or overnight or something. And then come back and do the rest of them like that. And uh, like I said, it takes a long time. And, you know, if I had a different way to show you guys, I would. But that's, you know, going to take a long time to do. Um, it's going to take a long time to download this game. I'm sorry, but it is. But it works, and I'm going to show you that it works. Um, it does have a couple problems. Do not install these updates. Like it says on the website, install cracks, install this, install that, blah, blah, blah. Don't do it. Um, you do need to follow how to change the language. Because it's going to be in Chinese. So go to where the game's at, and I'll show you that real quick. Um, wherever you downloaded these files to, it'll go to your downloads. And you're going to have a ton of RAR files, you know. And so, if you have WinWar, press Extract to um, Extract to, and then the name of the folder, and uh, then it'll extract it. That takes a little bit of time too. But this does not need to install. Most of their games do, but this one is literally you just extract it, and it's the directory. So that's good. Um, the RAR files you're gonna find out they do have a password on them but this guy is not a douchebag about them he gives you the password right right here 
UNRAR with password igg-games.com. It's just the website. It's completely legit, guys. I'm, I promise you. You can comment down below, Oh, virus, oh this, oh that, oh this, oh that. Every single one of my videos has been real so far, so why would I make a fake one now? Trying to advertise some guy's website. I'm not. This actually works. So, you know, I'm not gonna put no password, because it's got one. But they give you the password. You don't have to, like, go through surveys to get to the password, and go through this to get to that, and go through that to get to that. It's all here, so you're good. Um, anyway, guys, after you finally finish downloading every single 31 parts, it's gonna suck, I know. Time-consuming, as a motherfucker. You're gonna go to your downloads, and you're gonna extract it all at once to the same exact place. And I extracted mine just, because it's gonna be called igg preload is what the rods are gonna be named. And so, you're gonna wanna come here. Whenever you do it, it's gonna extract there. You're gonna go to here, and you're gonna see this is the directory. Now, do not try to launch the game from GTA 5 exe come here you do need to do this guys or the game will crash in game run gta5 launcher as admin after you come over to like this says right here to change your language um after you come to don't open this until you go to 3dmgame.ini which is right here open it with notepad and then edit your language to this right here and then, you know, that's that. And then you need to open up this, and don't try to sign in, because obviously you don't have the game. You know, I mean, you, you have the game, but don't try to pay for the game. Like, you didn't pay for it, so you get what I mean. Don't try to log in, just leave it alone. But that has to sit there. And then this is... I don't know what this is. This is another GTA launcher. I don't trust that. You want to use the launcher right here that's got a sketchy looking icon next to it and then make a, like a shortcut on your desktop or something and you know that's what I did with it and then I to get the GTA 5 thing here the symbol I went to properties and then you know you go over to general uh, you click how did I do this um I guess advanced no I don't know what I did to get the thing to show up. I don't know. I'm probably just not seeing it right now. Oh, change icon. <laughs> change icon. And then I went to browse and then browsed for the GTA 5 EXE and then did that. So, guys, this is probably going to take you a day to completely finish. But since I already downloaded it, um... I'm not going to obviously sit here and re-download it. And you're going to see people down here saying, like, press Q and dot, 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 crash. And that's why you have the launcher open, this thing. Because with that, it does not crash whenever you press Q, which is to get on cover. So you should be good to go then. Uh, this is moddable completely, all different kinds of stuff like that. So, you know, it does work. Um, and right now, I'm going to, you know, basically index that. So really, all you have to do is just do what I've told you, and I know it takes forever. And, you know, it takes a long time, but it works. Hold on, guys. Anyway, guys, I promise you that does work. It takes forever, but it does work. Um, now I'm gonna open this up and show you guys that it does work and so yeah I will literally like be right back guys hey guys and welcome back alright so we are in game on GTA 5 this is you know obviously the one you just you know downloaded and if you followed all the steps and did it right um obviously you're gonna start in the beginning of the game like you usually do in GTA 5 uh, I downloaded a save and kinda you know cheated to get through a lot more of the game. This is the game uh, on PC. Uh, it's really fun, guys. I'm not even kidding. I love this game on PC. Better than on 
any other system, to be honest. I mean, I haven't played next gen or anything, so I wouldn't know about that yet. This is as close as I have to next gen right now. But, uh, you know, the game does work. You know, as you can see from the video, uh, the game does work. Rather well, actually. Um, couple notes though, guys. Multiplayer does not work. Um, it is not cracked yet, so it's not working. Um, you can't even go to it. And just a quick update, couple updates while we're in game playing here real quick, if you care to stick around and listen. Um, Carolina Reaper. Uh, I promised that when I hit 500 subscribers, I would be eating one. And I'm not backing out on that yet. I am still going to do that. Um, I'm doing that, if all goes as planned, Tuesday. Um, as long as everything goes to plan, goes as planned, uh, I should be buying them on Tuesday and doing the video Tuesday night. And, yeah, so we should be good on that. But anyway, guys, this was how to get GTA 5 for free. Um, if it helped you, if you follow the instructions, it should have helped you. But if this helped you, uh, go ahead and hit that like button. Because it would go ahead and that would really help me out a lot, guys, just hitting that like button. And maybe the subscribe button if you want to see more videos like this. Let me know. Uh, I've got a lot of requests for other games, but I know a lot of people want GTA 5. So, you know, I'm doing what's in really high demand right now. And GTA 5 is definitely uh, one of those things that's in very high demand right now. So, I'm definitely doing GTA 5. Um, so, yeah, that's why I'm doing it now. Because it was one of the, like the biggest games that's in demand. You know, it's new. People want it. So I decided, why not do it? People want it. Why not do it? You know? Um, this is controller compatible, by the way, guys. I'm just using mouse and keyboard to show you guys that it works with, you know, mouse and keyboard. That I'm using it. Oh, wait, it doesn't look like I'm playing on Xbox One or something. You know, I will grab the controller right now and switch. I'm on controller now. I'm on controller now. This is actually a lot easier to use, by the way. Uh, if you don't know, controllers a whole lot easier to use the mouse and keyboard. If you've got an Xbox controller or a PS3 controller, I highly recommend it over mouse and keyboard any day. I love me a controller, man. Even for PC. Alright, guys. So, yeah, this was it. Um... I should also get a, I'm going to be getting a multiplayer video game, a co-op multiplayer of World at War, um, Zombies, me and my friend Zoman have that planned very soon, so stay tuned for that, and stay tuned at the end of this video for the first ever intro, or outro on my channel, so you should see the outro right after this video, at the end of it. And at the end of that, you're going to see another video and some other things. So, you know, have fun with that. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I had fun making it for the last four hours. So, you know, that was awesome. Stupid technical difficulties and stuff. As soon as I die, I'm going to end the video, guys. So, anyway, guys. So, this was how to get GTA 5 for free. Uh, it is unfortunately single player only. But it does work. So, I hope this video helps you out, and if it does, make sure to hit that like button, and subscribe if you're new, and request games down below. If you need help, let me know down in the comments, I can try to help as best as I can, and until next time guys, I'll see you later. I can't believe you really bit that. Did you really- <laughs> Okay, chew it. Uh-uh. <laughs> You're not going to chew it? Uh-uh.